Good morning guys! Today is December 13th and it is also my anniversary with my husband. Not our wedding anniversary but it is eight years that we have been together. December 13th, 2009, Abubakar told me he loved me for the first time and that is what we consider our anniversary because he never asked me to be his girlfriend. We just, you know, work. We just existed. We manifested. Together we were. And today is also very special because it's the day that we conceived Michael. <laughs> I don't know if that's creepy or cute. So as you guys know, I spent a great deal of time trying to regulate my cycles and to conceive Michael and I knew my body down to the point like every little tick or talk I knew exactly what it was and what it meant and I know based on my ovulation schedule and the times that we had intercourse that December 13th 2016 was the day that I conceived my son I'm just stating facts people so in honor of our beautiful family and December 13th being such a big day, I'm going to do a little montage to the Balos. So roll it. <laughs> Are you? No. I'm so sorry. Oh my gosh! That's why you weren't drinking. I feel so sad. So obviously, I'm like on high alert. I'm like, so we having a baby? So today is a very, very special video because baby Michael is finally here. Mm. <laughs> Honey, you want Baba? You want Baba? You want Baba? You want Baba, baby? You want Baba? Mama has to give you Baba sometimes now, honey. You want it? Huh? <laughs> yeah. Sorry, honey. Mommy has to go back to work in a couple weeks. I know. That's how I feel. So I'm starting to wean Michael, and I just pumped five ounces in literally less than five minutes. So I guess my body's ready. But I'm not. I'm literally so desperate. I'm like flipping through catalogs like, what the hell am I going to buy my mom? I have no clue. I need to get her something meaningful. Can you guys help me? Honestly, I need help. I'm going home next Friday, and I need you guys to tell me what to buy her. She loves home stuff, like all kinds of like decor, plates, stuff like that. Um, she's like really excellent at interior design. I would say she's pretty, pretty cute, pretty chic. And she's very sentimental, so I wanted to do something with Michael. Any ideas of things I can incorporate? Michael into. She's not much of a gadget person. 
I've bought her like so many watches in my life, I can't even take it. I need help. Please, please send help. I just want to say I think it's ridiculous that it's 4.15 and the sun is already setting. Like, why is the winter this way? Well, Michael's taking a nap. Um, he's been sleeping a lot different. His pattern is changing. I know he's coming up on four months. And I know that there is the four-month sleep regression. It doesn't seem like a regression necessarily. It's just that he's awake a lot more often during the day. His naps are a lot shorter. He doesn't sleep all the way through the night just yet. He still wakes up to eat one time in the night um, and then he sleeps the rest of the time. 2017 has been a very interesting year. I pretty much started this channel talking about my pregnancy and my experience on trying to conceive and now it's evolved into vlogs and you guys getting to know me personally and I still want to create that content that I was creating before. It's just hard to do that and vlog every day so I've been vlogging but for the next 12 days leave in the comments some topics that you guys want me to discuss we can still do uh, nap time chronicles just do it like more informal I can still talk about the topics but it will be like vlog format I'm gonna do something I know it's late but, but I'm gonna make myself like decent so that when my husband comes home I at least look nice remember when I first started vlogging I used to always try and look nice by the time my husband came home ain't that funny <laughs> Ooh, that was funny. I have a work party tomorrow and I have a friend party Saturday. So tomorrow Abubakar is gonna watch the baby and then on Saturday his little sister is gonna watch the baby. So that should be fun. I don't know what I'm gonna wear. Um, probably something that I just got. I don't know. I, I don't know if I'm gonna wear this wig tomorrow or if I'm gonna wear my hair curly. It depends on the outfit because you know sometimes you like an outfit with curly hair and sometimes you like an outfit with straight hair. Is that just me? Okay so here's the look. Bubakar loves red lips, so I threw some of those on. Um, I got dressed up, but I just realized this outfit's kind of bomb. I might want to save this for one of my holiday parties. Isn't this cute? Can you see it? It's like the little choker. Hmm. Might have to change into something else because this is a little cute. So I might want to save this for when people going to see me. You know what I'm saying? Especially since it's almost 6 o'clock and I'm just putting this on. So... Let me change. <laughs> okay, so I just put on this little off-the-shoulder black dress. It's pretty simple. Simple, cute. Ooh. I like it. This is actually a maternity dress, but I'm gonna need you to mind your business. Mind your business, okay? So Mr. Balo is home. And what did you think of your darling wife? Very nice. You're very beautiful, babe. Thank you. He was surprised. He was like, oh, what made you get dressed? He was gonna take me out to dinner, but I'd rather just order in because we're gonna be out tomorrow and we're gonna be out Saturday and I just wanna like spend time with the baby who's having a fit right now. Hello, hi honey. Blowing bubbles. So yeah, what should we order, honey? Do they deliver? Yeah, they do. 